Good morning, everyone. It's not as early in the morning as I had planned last night if I wasn't going to be sick today, which, by the way, is why I haven't posted a video in two days. If you don't follow my Twitter, is because I was sick for the past two days, and it's actually really weird because usually I, like, get <clears throat> better within, like, a day, and... Like, the fact that it took two days was really weird. Like, the only time that's happened is when I got the flu, like, once. And, like, my whole life, I've only had the flu once. I don't know why I told you guys that. It's just a little fun fact of the day, I guess. I don't know. And it's not as early in the morning as I would have liked, because when I woke up this morning, it was, like, nine-ish. And I was laying in bed, as you do, and I was checking my Twitter, as you do, and I saw that Charles Axtell, that he was doing a U now, and I really want to support him and everything that he does, because he's a really big, like, <clears throat> I guess, like, supporter, for lack of a better word. I know I just said support, but, um, of the LGBT community, and he does a lot of awesome things. Like, I sent in footage to him, uh, like a couple of months ago before I left to come here when I was traveling and uh, cause it was a video for um, straight guys that support gay rights and I'll leave his channel link and the link to that video below and you should go subscribe to him cause he's like so close to hitting 700 and that would be so awesome to get him there. Speaking of subscriber counts, <laughs> I'm like officially like four subscribers, four, that's less than one hand away from hitting a hundred subscribers and that would just be like completely awesome to reach that like I, don't, I can't tell you how long I've wanted that goal and now that it seems like attainable like I'm I'm so psyched for it to happen awesome segue see what I did there and that's someone else I want to shout out to is Steve he runs Steve H vlogs I'll leave his link in the description also like the past couple days that I've been sick like he's gained me almost like 10 subscribers from using his like Twitter resources and I just want him to know how much I appreciate that. Steven that was for you. Southern California has been really crazy this last week like last night I woke up in the middle of the night like like raindrops hitting my face through my window which was really fucking weird but now it's like sunny outside and there's like barely any clouds out. Um, and so now that I'm like not sick anymore, I want to go and do something really fun. And uh, I'm gonna go to back to a place I've been to before called Seaport Village. And the reason I'm going back is because the last time that we went there, we only explored like like a, a tiny bit of like what that has to offer from the pictures I've seen and everything. And I want to go and experience everything that that place has to offer.
walk out one of the openings, you totally forget you're even in the ship. It just seems like you're in some mall or something. <laughs> Thank you. I already saw this from up there. Right there. This is what I really came here for. This is what I wanted to see. Check this shit out. I've been back for a couple hours and I had so much fun like everything that's ocean I love it like I've gone on a submarine now I've gone on a battleship I'm in love with the ocean since I've been back I caught up on all the YouTube videos that were posted today I got to be part of something pretty momentous I don't know if people have done this before but I've never attended one it was a wedding like a Google Plus Hangout, they set up the computer with like a mic so that you could hear everything that was going on and James Red and Christy, now Red, got married and like they broadcasted it for the world to see and that's pretty incredible. I felt really special like to be able to be a part of something like that was pretty unique and incredible. And I just checked my YouTube and I'm down to three subscribers away from 100. We're so close guys, we're so close. We're like right on the cusp. Get out in the world, do something creative. Later.